Vodic Pro X Quick Tip Create your own custom track icons. This is actually super fun and a way for you to style your tracks in the sequencer. Let me show you right now. Alright, so I hope you are using the track icons feature to organize your projects because it is a great way to get a visual overview of all your tracks and instruments in your sequencer. Logic actually comes with a really well organized preset bank for track icons. But have you ever tried adding your own icons? It is super easy. Instead of using these icon folders, you simply go down here and choose the custom icons folder. So I have already created a couple of track icons of my own here. So let me explain my reasoning for creating these specific icons. This first one is an image of Omnisphere that I sometimes want to use for a track where Omnisphere is loaded as the instrument. The next one is an image of Contact, which I sometimes use as a default icon for an empty instance of Contact. I use that a lot in my DAW project templates. The next one is a close-up image of the buttons on my complete control keyboard, so that I know that this track is a complete control track, which I then can use the browse button on to load up the complete control instrument browser. And finally, I have my brand logotype, which I often use on track stacks for sketching, mockups, ideas and so on. Alright, now to create your own custom icon. You simply need to either download an image from the internet, take a screenshot on, for example, a plugin, or even create one using an image editing software. So let's say you have created an awesome custom patch that kind of sounds like the Horn of Gondor from The Lord of the Rings. Well, let's search for Horn of Gondor. Click on Images. And you probably want a close-up image because the track icons are really small. So let's go with this one. Download it to your computer. Then, back in Logic, you right-click on the track icon on the specific track, choose Custom Icons down here, and then you click this plus sign. Now you need to remember where you downloaded the image on your computer. I have it in my Downloads folder here. So you simply choose the image, click open, and BAM! You have yourself the Horn of Gondor in your Logic project. And the best part is that these track icons are global, meaning that you can add any of your custom track icons in any project you work on. Great! Now create some inspiring, specific, or perhaps even nerdy looking track icons that you can use in your Logic projects. Do you want to truly master Logic Pro X for composing and producing music? Then join my Facebook group Logic Pro X for Professionals right now.